Hey, if this is your first time checking out this channel, my name is Jeff Teresi. I'm so grateful you're here. Two questions. Are you holding yourself accountable to maximizing your potential? And how different do you think your life would be if your thoughts, words, actions, relationships, and pursuits were all in alignment to help you be your best self in all areas of your life? Well, today I'm going to show you a very simple way to get started on both. Today I'm going to show you how to plan for success. True success. And what is true success? It's being able to be your best self one day at a time. You see, after years of developing, refining, and simplifying this process, I'm excited to say the final product can fit on just one page. I call it the One Page Plan for Success, or PFS for short. Be sure to watch to the very end. I've got a fun gift for you if you do. Did that sound creepy? So let's start by taking a look at an example of a purpose-filled plan. As you can see, we have here a bank heist. Bank heist? <laughs> I apologize. That is for a different seminar I teach. You are not supposed to see that. Let's just pretend that didn't happen, okay? Side note, how are you holding yourself accountable? Did you know that living up to your full potential requires accountability? This is where it all comes together. This is how you assure action and protect progress. In the book, The Seven Key Abilities, there are three main accountability tools. The Accountability Partnership, the Daily Checklist Planner, and the One Page Plan for Success. And while I'd love to go into depth in all three, we couldn't possibly, because we don't have enough time to do a full day workshop or a two day seminar. The other two will just have to be covered in future episodes. For now, I can touch on just one, the One Page Plan for Success. The key is to be strategically accountable. You see, for me, nothing moves the needle farther or faster than having a strategically accountable plan in place. One that ensures my thoughts, words, actions, relationships, and pursuits are all in alignment to help me be my best self in all areas of my life. Now it goes without saying, but I'm gonna say it anyway because it might actually need to be said. Putting a plan in place requires some amount of planning. Trying to succeed without having a plan in place would be like throwing darts at a wall in the dark. Not only would you have no idea if you're hitting the target, but you wouldn't even know if there even is a target. And that's how so many of us are living our lives. We're throwing darts at a wall in the dark. Well, it's time to step out of the darkness and into the light. It's time to put a plan in place. Now, it's important to note that it's possible to spend too much time planning. At one point, I spent too much time planning. At one point, I spent so much time planning, it actually prevented me from following through with the plan in the first place. It's a little bit embarrassing, but at one point, I decided I would spend 30 minutes a day to review my plan that at the time was 15 pages long. Guess how long that lasted? One day. Don't make the same mistake. A detailed plan is great, but be careful not to overcomplicate. My plan has since been simplified. It's one page. I call it the One Page Plan for Success, or PFS for short. And it's based on this simple premise. You can succeed in every area of your life if you choose life-giving thoughts, words, actions, relationships, and pursuits. So let's unpack that a bit. How would you define success? What is true success? See, here's the problem. Most people view success as a destination. When in reality, it's a way of life. It goes way beyond just accomplishing a goal or achieving a dream. While that may be part of it, true success is being able to consistently make choices that bring joy and meaning to your life and the lives of others. Let me say that again. True success is being able to consistently make choices that bring joy and meaning to your life and the lives of others. It all comes down to choices the decisions we make on a daily basis. What will you think? What will you say? What will you do? Who supports you? And what will you pursue? These are questions we all have to ask ourselves and decisions we all have to make. And when each answer you give helps you to be your best self, well now you have a plan in place. And when each answer you give can be found in one place on one page, well now you have your very own PFS, your very own one page plan for success. 
Would you like to hear a few examples from my PFS? Hopefully you said yes. So in my PFS, one thing I think is we, not me. Because I know that the quality and beauty of my life is in direct proportion to the quality and beauty I ascribe to others. One thing I say is you can do this. Because I know my words are meant to empower and encourage others. One thing I do is keep a gratitude journal. I call it my eternal journal, which I've been doing for over 10 years now. One person who supports me is my wonderful wife. And all of you watching this, of course. And one thing I pursue is helping people break through to their next big breakthrough. So what are some of your answers to those five questions? Please leave it in the comment section below. Now keep in mind, we are different people, so your answers will be different than mine, but the point is that it follows along the same line. You see, the easiest decision to make is one you've already made. So if you ever find yourself in a place where you're not quite sure what to think, or you don't know what to say, or you don't know what to do, just refer back to your PFS. In fact, one of the actions in your PFS should be to review your PFS each day. In doing so, you can begin to experience some of its many benefits. For starters, it can serve as an anchor to peace in the present and a bridge to further fun in the future. It can direct your decisions and protect your perspective. And most importantly, it can enable you to optimize each day and actually enjoy the process along the way. It's a pretty cool tool and has helped me tremendously. And I believe it can help you too. So I want to end today by asking the same question I started with. How different do you think your life would be if your thoughts, words, actions, relationships, and pursuits were all in alignment to help you be your best self in all areas of your life. Now for that free gift I promised. I went ahead and made a one-page plan for success, instructions, and template available to download for free at jeffteresi.com. Your mission this week, if you choose to accept, is to begin working on your very own plan for success. Plan for at least 73 hours, I mean one hour, to get started. And just review it each day and update it often. So remember, you can succeed in every area of your life if you put a plan in place and keep it simple. So create your very own PFS just as soon as you can. If you do, you will break through to your next big breakthrough. Hey, I come out with one new video every week. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, be sure to hit that subscribe button and ding that bell so you're notified when the next one comes out. If you learned something of value from this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. It helps me out tremendously. And don't forget to share this with at least 319 people that you love or like or know. Until next time, remember, you're not alone. You are loved. And whatever you do, believe in yourself. All right. Um, all right.